we are here with Jackson Dean, who will be on the red carpet. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? I'm good. How are you? Uh, such a young guy and such a deep, manly <laughs> voice. It's amazing. Thank you. I'm starstruck. I mean, I have been rooting for you since day one. When I first heard your song, I was like, have y'all heard this new kid? I'm like, Jackson Dean is blowing it up. But I have a confession. Maybe the mo, maybe the rocket. Maybe the great salt plains or the hills of Kentucky. I thought you were from Kentucky the whole time. And she then I got to look at you. from Kentucky. I did. Yes, Every dude. single time I really? introduced you on the air, I was like, he's from Kentucky. He's 21. You're 22 now. 22 now. And yeah, I just right. kept saying that. And then I got to looking at the prep and I was like, he's from Maryland. How was I? How did this happen? I do like me. I do like me some Kentucky, but yeah, Maryland born and raised. Blue crabs all the way. Oh yeah. I, I can all clean them out too. Yeah. Like, all day. Go pick some crabs, dude. I will. I'll throw down. We run football and crabs. That's right what Maryland now. does. Yeah, that's what we do. Yeah. You don't buy them. That's sacrilege. Yeah. We run a 1600 foot trot line. Let's go. That is uh, awesome. All right. So, what is your background? What brought you into the business? And what are your what influences? Is your well. I was raised by a bricklayer in Stonemason. Uh, so we all, my siblings and I all worked for him since birth. And when our house burned to the ground, I went up in there and while we were rebuilding and would play in there at night. And my dad heard me one night and he was like, why don't you learn a couple songs? I'll take you to an open mic. Long story short, a year later, went to the bar that is really the only bar in the town. And my grandfather, my great grandfather actually built it. But anyway, got up there, did a couple songs and it just kind of, snowballed into that and that was 14 when that happened. Wow. Holy moly. So you've been less than an overnight success. I mean, an overnight oh, yeah. success pretty much. Mm, it's amazing. Yeah, I've been at it a while. That's, That's great. Awesome. I'm so excited. Are you just, who who do you want to meet? Like, who's the one person you want to yeah, maybe collaborate with or meet? I've met quite a few people, you know, and, and meeting them most of the time is enough for me, you know. Probably Stapleton, that, but that was one of my oh, one yeah. of my biggest because I found him when he was with the Steel Drivers okay. and the Johnson Brothers records, which is like when he went and did his rock stuff and whatnot. And I heard his voice, and I was like, I want to be able to control it like that. And I want to be able to do that, and especially like just his vocal and his guitar playing, which is like what I've tried to emulate. Yeah. So yeah, Stapleton. Oh, I would love to hear you with Stapleton. Yeah. So we've got Jackson Dean here. We're so excited to have him. Uh, CMAs are tonight, and he's going to be all suited up. Who are you taking with you to the awards? Myself. Just yourself? And, and Bridger, my day to day. Oh, my gosh. That's awesome. <laughs> yeah. Bridger's going with you, man. You're. I, did, I, didn't, I figured next, like when I go and get nominated, I'll take my mom. You take yeah. your mom. Oh, yeah. I'll take your mom when you get nominated. we got a little quiz for you real quick. All right. Okay. This is the QDR quick quiz this morning for Jackson Dean. What food do you avoid at all times, or can't stand Chinese food. Chinese food. I was going to say no he's un-American, un -Amer un but that no, wouldn't be right. No way. No way. <laughs> uh, what is something normal you can't do? Snap your fingers, or whistle, or swim, or take a selfie. <laughs> Some people uh, got little pterodactyl arms, you know. Oh my God! I can't do the. Pat my stomach and or no the rub my stomach. Yeah, and pat my head. Head. I can't, I can't <laughs> do that. I've right. never been able to. One, one more. One more. What's the worst whooping you ever got, and what did you do to deserve? Pretty sure it was the first time I cursed my dad. I was like 10 years old. And he threw me across the front yard. <laughs> Yep, he threw him across the front yard. Jackson Dean here, CMA broadcast, media broadcast, Mike and Amanda, 94.7 QDR.